On Monday, a group of people who support liberal ideas asked the Michigan Supreme Court to review a decision that lets Donald Trump stay on the list of candidates for president. This is part of a series of fights in state courts about a rule in the Constitution that says people involved in a rebellion can't hold office, and if this rule should stop Trump from trying to be president again. A group called Free Speech for the People didn't agree with the decision made last week by the state appeals court. This decision said that the Republican Party can choose anyone they want for the list of candidates in the primary election, even if that person isn't really qualified for the job. Now, this disagreement might lead to another big decision by the Michigan Supreme Court about Trump's chances of becoming president again. Something similar already happened in Minnesota, where the Supreme Court said Trump should stay on the list for the primary. And if people have a problem, they can try again in the main election. In Colorado, there's a judge's decision about whether the rule against rebels in the 14th Amendment applies to Trump's case. The Colorado Supreme Court will soon make a decision on that. There's a chance that one of these situations might reach the highest court in the country, the U.S. Supreme Court. This court has never given an opinion on the specific rule section 3 in the Constitution. This rule was added after the Civil War to stop people who were on the side of the Confederates from coming back into government roles. This year, many cases have been started to stop Trump from trying to be president again, but none of them have succeeded so far. As these legal fights continue, people are keeping a close eye to see if the courts will change the way things are, or if it will just be another chapter in the story of Trump's possible return to the presidency.